I'm Patrick Bias and I'm an actor and a filmmaker. It's not all about the fame to me. It's about making my family happy, making a difference, having my voice be heard, and showing everyone what I actually go through to become successful. Right now I'm on my way to go do a little bit of work for on Blue Bloods. They want me to come back in to, to handle some things. It's been a crazy day. Found out that one of my friends got killed. It's just like, it's just crazy right now. How are you doing? I'm here to, for Blue Bloods. Yeah. All right. Got to the spot. About to do a little bit of work on Blue Bloods for a little bit. Okay. Scene, we'll play the scene for uh, Patrick. Should I put the headphones on now? No, you can hear it in the room here. Okay. Yeah, we're just going to play it. Okay. Just got done working on some stuff for Blue Bloods. I'm not going to tell y'all what it is, but we working on some stuff. All right, my man. You're a great editor, and I appreciate you catch up on you, everything. You're going to make me look good on stage because you gave me a performance. I did. Thank you so much. <laughs> Check him out. I'm not an editor. Tell I'm an associate name. producer. Oh, tell everybody your name. Shannon Fogarty. Shan Shannon Fogarty. That's the right. Associate producer. That's He's right. The man right here. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Hello. Patrick. How are you? Hi. Well, Lindsay. Patrick. What do you do? Thank you. Engineering. Thank you. Engineering. Yeah, exactly. Oh, I talking here. My man right here, though, the engineer on set. He catching it. <laughs> Just got done. Make sure y'all check out Blue Bloods season six. Check me out on Blue Bloods coming up yeah this is going to be cool october 2nd check me out on blue bloods guest star we out here in new york city it's really been a long day long night really couldn't sleep so much found out one of my friends got murdered found out that he got stabbed in a building. Last time I had spoken to him, he had told me that, you know, he's on his grind and on his hustle to actually do a lot of good and big things for himself. And I've been keeping up with him on Facebook and you know tracking, you know, seeing seeing how he's doing. And he's been doing, he's been he's been stepping his stuff up and he's been, you know, paving the way for himself really crazy to know like somebody's so evil or messed up would take someone's life who you really really care about and it's just like everyone knew who he was and everyone knew that he was a good person and it's just really really unfortunate to to get some news like that and knowing that his family is going through through this right now I really pray and hope that his family actually heal from this. And Nut, he was a he was a good person. He was a really really good person. Kind-hearted, loving, caring. Very smart, very intelligent. And he was on the verge to become big big. And it's really, really, really sad that this happened to him. Violence gotta come to an end. This is like really, really sad and crazy. Violence really, really, really has to come to an end. I hate doing laundry. Yeah. I'm, that's like my on my Twitter handle is. They hate I've laundry. Always procrastinating <laughs> my laundry. I think I wait till like the last sock. <laughs> yeah. And you're like, can I make it to Target to go and buy new socks, or should I just do my laundry? Or should I might reuse this sock? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs>